South King County lagging behind in vaccination rates. We're getting some federal assistance. FEMA is now teaming up with local public health to boost the number of vaccines that are going out. Fox 13's Matthew Smith is live in federal way this afternoon. And Matt, you're actually hearing they could give out hundreds of shots a day. Yeah, that's if the people actually show up. Uh, so people need to get the word out. Uh, the DOH website is taking people and you can get signed up to come right here to the Federal Way Performing Arts and Event Center. Now, you can also just walk in. They have some availability for those who don't want to sign up in advance. It was very painless. I didn't have to get out any, you know, card info or anything for, I mean, I do have insurance, but you didn't have to fill out anything because it's all covered and free. And um, like I said, I was just getting my booster, but if you got your first uh, two rounds of shots today, they were giving out gift cards for people. So that's a win-win. <laughs> Andy Martin, who you just heard from, one of the first people we saw today getting their shot. Uh, but they say as many as 500 people could get access every day here at this FEMA mobile clinic. In her experience, uh, what they want to hear here, because they're trying to make access easier for everyone. Unlike many of the other sites that have been giving out the vaccine, this particular site will be offering up the shots in the afternoon and the evening hours. The goal is to reach as many of the South King County residents who don't work from home and may have had trouble going to some of the traditional clinics and also families. So beginning today and through January 4th, they're going to be administering doses here from 2 o'clock in the afternoon until 9 at night. Note, they will take four days off Christmas Eve, Christmas, New Year's Eve Day, and New Year's Day. Otherwise, they're equipped to get 300 to 500 shots out a day. That includes kids, adults, first-time shots, second doses, and boosters. So the good news, obviously, the resources are here. Even though it is inside, this is considered a mobile clinic, the bad news they need the help out here because not enough people are getting the shot. South King County, they have a much lower vaccine rate than Northern King County. So I'm told the stretch here will last two weeks. After they're done here, they're going to stay in South King County. In fact, they plan to move on over to Auburn. We'll be able to nail down the exact days and times, but they're thinking now that they'll stick with that two to nine time frame. We're live in Federal Way. I'm Matthew Smith, Fox 13 News.